This is what you'll need to make your red beans and rice. Have smoked sausage, an onion, two cloves of garlic, bay leaves, jalapeno salsa, diced tomatoes with jalapeno, rice, light red chili beans, one pound, Creole seed, black pepper, grain lady onion powder, and garlic powder. Let me get my onion cut it, my garlic diced, and I'll be back. Okay, I just sorted through my beans, and now I'm trying to make sure there's no, so sometimes there's little rocks and little beans that, in there, that are in there that are no good. I pick, pick through them and take them out, and then I just put them in this grainer and rinse them off, and put them in some water and bring them to a boil, and as soon as they come to a boil, then I just turn them off and cover them and let them sit for about an hour. It's a quick soaker. I'm, I'm going to do that. I have my onions cut up in my garlic mince. And then I'm going to cut my sausage up. And I'll be Okay, back. my beans have came to a boil now. I'm just going to put the top over them. Cover them. Turn off the heat. And just let them sit here for about 35, 45 minutes to an hour. And then... I'll be ready to rinse them and start them to boil. Okay, here are the beans. They've been sitting about 35 to 45 minutes. And I'm going to drain them and rinse them, and I'll be back. Okay, I'm draining them now. And I just run some hot water over and rinse them. Here are the beans. They've been rinsed and drained. I have two cups of water that I'm going to pour on them. Onion powder. Garlic powder. Pep black pepper. My two bay leaves. And I'm going to put the salt in it at the very end because the salt is known to make the beans hard. So I'm going to wait till the very end before I put those in once they start cooking and get, getting tender. And I'll be back. I'm going to add another cup of water because it doesn't look like there's enough in there. They're not covered. And then I'm going to turn them on medium heat and let them cook for about... 45 minutes and I come back to check on Here's my onion sauteing. I'm going to add a little Creole seasoning to my onion. Just to give it a little spice. And I'm going to add in my garlic. Once I finish with this, I will fry my sausages and take I'll take these out and fry my sausages alone and then I'll be back. I've taken my garlic and onions out. Now I'm putting my sausage in to fry. I'm gonna brown those on both sides and then I'll be back. Okay now the beans have been going about 45 minutes. Now I'm gonna add in some chicken broth, one full can, I fill this chicken broth can up with some water, so I'm adding another can of water, I'm adding in this salsa, Creole seasoning. Stir it around. Test it for seasoning.
Now I'm going to let this go about 25 more minutes and let it thicken up, uncover, and then, okay, the timer is going off. It's thick, but not as thick as I want it. I'm going to let it keep going. And I was going to pour this can of diced tomatoes in there, but I take, I poured the juice off of it and poured it in there. And it's, I taste it and it's a little bit spicy. And I'm afraid if I pour all those tomatoes in there, it's going to be too spicy. So I'm not going to pour those. I'm just going to save them for another recipe. And I'm going to add in my garlic, onions, and my sausage right now. And I'm going to let this go for about another 25 minutes. And it'll probably be thickening up my beans are still a little bit firm so I'm gonna let it keep going until this soft my beans are softened and this gravy on my beans are thickened up okay the timer has gone off but my beans are still a little bit firmer than I would like you see it has thickened up but like I said the beans are still a little bit firm so I'm going to add some more water. And you just have to keep doing it. This is about a cup. Until they soften to your liking. And it's thick like you want it. So I guess I have to let this go about another 15 to 20 minutes. Or just until my beans soften like I want. Okay, here's the beans now. It has thickened up and the beans has has softened and I'm just cooking some rice according to the instructions on the bag and that's it and I did not use that whole package of sausage I just used half because I cooked another type of meat to go with this okay guys here's the finished product I like, I like the way you make Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe, and check the description box for the ingredients. Thanks for watching, and see y'all in the next video.